Hey beautiful people, a quick dragon fruit tip. When you have your dragon fruit plants, you can prune them. I will be pruning mine. So when you see so much shoots coming out, you can prune them back. And you just do that by snipping right where the bud is. So that's what I'll be doing with mine. This helps the dragon fruit plants to be more robust and also the possibility of it pushing out fruits gets higher so that it doesn't waste its energy on new branches. So I have a pretty good setup here. So I don't really need a lot of branch going all over the place. So I will be pruning mine because I want fruits to come in soon. So I'm going to put down the phone and do some pruning and... Um, also show you guys how i um how i propagate so i'm gonna use these cuttings and show you guys how i do my propagation all right guys soon come okay guys so i have six cuttings here that i got from the the mother plant and i am just going to leave them here for about a week i have some more here that i got from the mountains but these are from my plant and I'm going to leave them here for a week. And the reason being is that I want the ends of the new cutting to get healed, basically. So it's a cut. I want it to scab up and heal so that when I move on to the next stage of the propagation, I don't want water to go up in there and dry and water rot it right so this is the next step the next step is to have a container with soil it doesn't have to be full all the way and you just put the cuttings in there about an inch or so and you water this like every week and after a while you will see roots start to emerge so this one is an example see those tiny little hairs at the end those are roots coming in let me see if i can show you so you see the roots there coming right and i'm just gonna leave this one in there some more and let it be way more established and this would be the second to last stage and then after now the roots are fully established i move on to this phase here where i pot them out so these guys have properly established roots and these will be available by the end of the week i just want it to be more established in the pot and they're good to go some are already giving me new growth so this is a sign of a healthy healthy cutting that is ready for its new home and after you have gotten your dragon fruit they're going to take off like this and they will need some sort of support um what i did with mine i did this post i made it had this post made and buried it in the ground against the wall and then i took the 10 inch pot that they were in and we cut the bottom of the pot and then bury the pot as is so as to not disturb the plant by taking it out of the pot and you know it's very prickly so i couldn't couldn't manage that life so we just cut out the bottom bury it and this is how they have been growing um i do dragon fruits they go up and trail over they will also attach to things so if i show you i'll show you how they attach to the, the board here and me show you how they take roots out as well and they have attached themselves to the wall so it's pretty much on the wall established on the wall um they do this on trees as well so if you have like a big mango tree and you want it to take off and go up in the tree the only problem is that when they start to bear you have to climb the tree for the fruits but um they do attach the things um yeah this is basically it um i've these are where i did my cuttings from 
I kind of I wanted to cut this I may cut it later but we'll see I did not cut this one because I want to see what's happening here if it's going to flower or if it's a new growth if it's a new growth I'm definitely gonna cut it but the flowers also appear where the new growth appears right at these nodes so any of these nodes can become a dragon fruit flower which in turn becomes a dragon fruit itself so i do see something happening there so i'm not gonna trouble that um where else did i see something happening i see something happening here as well this looks more like Mommy. a new growth though Mommy. but yes papa To a butterfly. Yes, to a butterfly. So, yeah, Papa. It will grow to a butterfly. So, this is what's happening with my dragon fruit. I will keep you guys up to date with its development. And um, I have gotten some updates from people who have bought dragon fruit. I'm going to put some pictures right here. So, you guys can see some people have gotten fruits already. As usual, I am behind in the game. But I am playing catch up with my dragon fruit and my grapes but i'll get there but um thanks for watching guys i'll see you around all right bye